Hey, what up guys, this is Pastor Canova again, we're coming up with another video in C-Sharp and today we're going to be talking about parsing a string, okay? So, alright, so let's start, but before we start, please don't forget to like and subscribe uh, to the channel, we're growing slowly but steady, man, steady, alright, so let's do it, let's start with a console, console that, uh, that right, right here, and all that right line and then right here we're going to say enter the wage yeah so enter the wage okay so we're going to store this in a variable a nice string variable we're going to say wage so equals console that read line right here okay so this will work as long as the as long the user is entering a number, right? So we can parse that, and we can say int. We can say uh, int wage value equals two. We can say int that parse wage. Yeah, and then we just do that, yeah. Pass pass that in value wage. And this will work, right? Because we're we're gonna be entering a just a um, a number. So if we run this, it wouldn't give us that much. So what about if we wanna do like a, a pass um a pass and a fail person? Okay, well, let's do that before we do that, okay? Uh, let's comment this out right here. Uh, maybe just get rid of this part right here. Cool beans. So now we can just say int. We're going to say uh, wage. Wage value. Semicolon. And then we can just do if. We're going to say if um, and that try try parse uh, right there or just right there, bro. Try parse and right here we're going to do the following. We're going to pass wage comma and we're going to see the out parameter. We're going to say uh, wage value. So we're going to pass that value and we're going to store it in wage value right here. Okay. Now we can say console. We're using the try parse method of function. And then here um, we're going to say the following uh, parsing was successful. That is for successful. And then we're going to say plus concatenate wage value. Okay. Else, let's copy this part right here just for fun to save some time. Pong. And then we're going to say parsing fail. Okay, let's run it right here and see what we have. So, enter the wage. Let's just do a hundred bucks. Parsing was successful. Okay, what about we enter letters? A, B, C, D, E, F. Yeah, whatever. Parsing failed. Yeah, so it didn't work. So that's because that how this is how we set it up. So anyway, guys, so this was just a very short video about parsing um, strings. So hopefully this can help you out. So don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll see you next. Have a good night. Bye.